Do you want to learn machine learning? Do you want to learn it using Python? Do you want to follow a guided tutorial that will provide you the step-by-step -step necessary to build your machine learning models and also description of the available options and functionality of the various components necessary for machine learning model building? If you answered yes, then you want to watch this video to the end because I'm going to share with you a very powerful website that you could use to jumpstart your machine learning journey. And so without further ado, we're starting right now. And so the machine learning resource that we're going to be talking about today is called the Machine Learning Mastery. And so the contents on the Machine Learning Mastery website provides you small bite-sized tutorials that you could easily implement into your own existing projects. And so whenever I get stuck, aside from going to Stack Overflow, I might also give this website a general browse in order to find some inspiration about which function to use, how to approach some of the machine learning problems. And so this website provides a very good resources for you for doing that. And so let's have a look at the functionality provided by this website. So upon arriving at the website, you're going to be shown the logo of the machine learning mastery and the slogan of this website and also a picture of Dr. Jason Brownlee. And if you're interested, you could also click here to get your free ebook and you have to provide your email and he will provide you some interesting tips in his email list. And there are three major components here. Quick start guide. So this will get you started immediately. Latest tutorial. So he will be releasing tutorials every day or every other day. And he will be posting that on the LinkedIn, on Twitter, and on Facebook. Okay. And contents from the tutorials will be categorized into the various categories, headings here that you see. And so if you like what you see, then you could also purchase some of the ebooks that Dr. Jason has written. And there are about 19 books that he has already written so far on various topics in machine learning and also deep learning. Okay, so let's click on the quick start guides. And so here it is nicely divided into four sections. So the first section is the foundation. So if you're first starting out, then He's recommending you how do you get started and then he's going to tell you the step-by-step -step process and then there will be an article about probability about statistical methods about linear algebra so let's have a look at the how do i get started okay so here he's providing you some of the tips on how you could get started so step one you have to adjust your mindset. Step two, you pick a process. And then step three, you pick a tool whether you would like to have a no code approach using Weka or if you would like to have some intermediate or advanced. And he's saying here that Python is more of an intermediate and advanced is the R platform. And then he discusses about how you could practice on data set and then how you could build your portfolio. Okay, some pretty solid advice on getting started. And then there will be other in the machine learning process, defining the problem, preparing the data, spot check the algorithms, improve the result, present the results and the probability for machine learning. And then there will be various article in the topics of probability. And then for statistics, there will be several topics as mentioned here and in linear algebra as well. So he has several articles written here. And then if you would like to get a general understanding of the underlying basis of the machine learning algorithms, then check out this. So here he provides a tour of machine learning algorithms, and then he provides you some information about overfitting, underfitting, and an explanation going in depth into each of the linear algorithms, nonlinear algorithms, ensemble algorithms, okay? And if you prefer a non-coding approach, then you could have a look at Weka. And he also has several articles about that, even a book about that as well. And Python machine learning using scikit-learn. So several articles about that. And also machine learning using R, particularly using the caret package. So not to be confused with the PyCaret. So PyCaret is a package in Python and it is not using caret, but it is using scikit-learn, xgboost, and catboost. But the name just resemble caret. Okay. And then he has some code algorithm from scratch where he's going to show you how to use Python in order to implement various machine learning algorithms from scratch. 
And he also has a section about time series forecasting, data preparation, how to implement XGBoost, how to handle imbalanced data sets when you have higher number of samples in one class versus the other class, okay? And how you could use Keras to do deep learning and talking about better deep learning performance, long short-term memory networks, deep learning for natural language processing, word embedding, backs of words model, language modeling, photo captioning, text translation, text summarization, text classification, and also using deep learning for computer vision. Covers many topics, image data handling, image data augmentation, image classification, object recognition, the basics of CNN, image data preparation, showing you how to use deep learning for time series forecasting, and also having a section about generative adversarial networks. All right, so that's pretty much it for the getting started. So let's head over back. And then let's have a look at the latest tutorial. So if you would like to have a look at the top tutorials that he has written, it is right here. How to install everything, your first complete project, your first neural network. Okay, so you can see here that he has published this recently, July 27, on the leave one out cross validation for evaluating machine learning algorithms. And on 24th of July, train test split for evaluating machine learning algorithms. On 22nd of July, how to selectively scale numerical input variables for machine learning. So I would normally browse this section of the website to see what interesting techniques or functions that we could use for our machine learning projects. And so the thing is, there is no expectation of having to learn things at the spot, but just by browsing casually, then you will learn a couple of things. Okay. So he'll release a video in a couple of days, about three to four days in between the articles. Okay, so let's have a look at the ebooks that he has written. Okay, so he has written some beginner friendly ebooks, linear algebra for machine learning, statistical methods for machine learning, probability for machine learning, master machine learning algorithms, machine learning algorithms from scratch. So let's have a look at the cost of the books here. So it's worthy to note that this video is not sponsored by Machine Learning Mastery. And so today we're covering Machine Learning Mastery because I truly believe it is a very great resource for learning machine learning. First book here is $27. Statistical Methods for Machine Learning. Let's have a look. And this is also $27. Okay, and let's have a look at the intermediate books. So there's Machine Learning Mastery with Wika. And so he will also provide you all of the code, all of the necessary data to follow step-by-step step in his tutorial. Machine Learning Mastery with Python, Machine Learning Mastery with R, Time Series Forecasting, Imbalance Classification, Data Preparation. So if you have done the beginner's level and the intermediate level, then I believe that you could pretty much tackle a lot of the machine learning tasks. And for the advanced topics, it is predominantly based on deep learning. And so here we have deep learning with Python. And so he's going to be using Theano and Keras. Deep learning for computer vision, generative adversarial network, how to have better deep learning, how to make better predictions, train faster, and reduce overfitting. LSTM network with Python, deep learning for time series forecasting. So they're predominantly based on the topics that he has already provided for free. And if you would like to have a deeper treatment into the topics, then it is recommended that you also purchase the book. So for one thing, to help the author out and that he could use that extra resource to write more books that are helping all of us in our data science journey. Okay, and if you buy the books in bundles, you'll be getting some discount here as well. So if you buy the beginner bundle, 34% discount. 
Okay, so if you would like to buy everything, it's going to be called the Super Bundle and it will be comprising of 19 books and at a discount of 31%. And so all of the 19 books will be costing you $467. So on average, it will cost about 20 something dollars. So considering that all of the books comes with actionable code that you could actually use to learn and refer to, I would say this is a very good deal. Okay. But don't take my word for it. And so he has some testimonials. And if you don't like the book, then you could ask him for a 100% money back guarantee. So there's no risk to this. Okay, and he also updates us in Twitter and LinkedIn and also Facebook. So if you're finding value in this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't yet done so, hit on the notification bell in order to be notified of the next video. And as always, the best way to learn data science is to do data science, and please enjoy the journey. Thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, and share, and I'll see you in the next one. But in the meantime, please check out these videos.